Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I am going to be playing some Call of Duty Modern Warfare. We are going to be doing the fourth part of the campaign today. Checked out with all my specifications? Mm-hmm. Won't find the half-baked rigs here. Oh. Feels nice. I think I'm ready to ruin someone's day. How about we grab a bite to eat on the way out, eh? Get properly fueled up. Ooh, before a fight? Nah. If I'm born on the attack, I need to be hungry. Like a predator. Come on. Let's get this thing set. Fellas gotta eat. Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Bell. Are you fucking serious right now? Don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on. Let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so, yeah. Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That sent a tidal wave of shit all the way up to DC. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head, well, I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. No, we were after a different spy in Quezon. <laughs> That's right. Our team was right next to Adler's when we touched down in Way City. That's also the first time I had the misfortune of meeting Hudson. <laughs> in all those years, nothing's changed. He still has the personality of a wet fucking blanket. Anyways, later. Yep. Oh, I gotta choose my mission. Hold on. Make it quick. I'm busy. Right. End of the line. I said we try and do... MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Soviet agents within multiple European government. So I'm just going to be doing the main missions for this one, and then I will do another part Hastings after left this Salt Lake City. Of track all of the side all the missions. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't going to happen. What's the plan? The last read we have. Oh, I accidentally skipped it. Oh well. My bad. My bad. My bad. I'm sorry. Jeez. Adler's late. No laugh. We're early. Adler should be checking in right about. Mark, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. What do I got? All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! I mean, I have a pistol and a sniper. I can't really do too much. Finding cover!
unlucky. I'm giving you a rocket to your own. That means I'm the best. Bye. Give me the AK-47. circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Mark. Where are these guys at? Recording the song. Oh, okay. hey! Hello, guys. This is Kiki. Say hi, Kiki. Alright. Spread out. Go, Dad. Find that nuke. I'm on the last part of the mission. Gotta find a nuke. Bye, I love you. their job. They love a reward. They've got closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp is Not a quick scope guy. That an ambush? Moving. I need suppressing fire. RPG on the balcony. We have a minute. Oh Lord. Oh God. Bye bye. Finally grab that drink when this is over. Your persistence is admirable, Lazar. That's not a no. Jesus, get a fucking room, you two.
Lovely. This will come in handy. Get on the camera feed spell. Why me? I want to shoot. I want to do shooties. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Where? Second floor, room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Let's Help. move. Get you there, Park. Well, crew, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Well, use the same wall. Staring at him, that's kind of weird. Please, they're shooting at us! No! No! Bro! I'll check the bullet. Oh, no. no! None of them survived. They were shooting at our kind, so I came for them. But dad, dad, so I'm safe. Canvas the room. Hastings, 
stop talking. Perseus was here. He shot us. Escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. I could give him full access to Greenwald. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. Blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go, no? Contact! Chopper coming in low! It's gotta be Perseus! All teams head to the roof! Move! Move! And we get a shit ton of reinforcements circling in front. Gun back. You know what? Screw it. I want my. I did get my gun back. Who cares? Take cover. Shit. Just. Well. Ah. Ground 
T My legs. contact in T minus ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. Bell, I feel like I owe you. We're going to lose a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn, the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? The memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Another flashback. Sixty-two frames. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Or maybe it was another one.
then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. Shotgun and had a bow with him. That's when we discovered a BC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Yes, good, the bunker. Now tell me about Perseus. Okay, ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently.
Yeah. Fire and water. See, told you, Liam. split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. You mentioned crossing a bridge near a village. you followed the road right toward the sound of gunfire. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16.
Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. This could be the onset of another fruitful seizure. Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck. Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a PC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. Path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. at the bunker across the bridge. You went left at the point, not right. A few 
two allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Another injection. Do it now. Heart rate is spiking. I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last. Get back your door. Come on. Everything's stabilizing. Heart rate is coming down now. doing in the lab. Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Bell, 
comrades. The United States and its allies slowly consume them. survive another round. Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, I've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next part. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. <laughs> Bell, go into the bunker now. Hold on in, Adler. Chill them. You're the only one who knows where Perseus is. Where he'll detonate the nukes. Where is he? Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You just told me I'm out of the trance now. You gotta admit I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. You just need to give the subject a name. Bell. confused. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Trapzone is stopping in Dubo. 
This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duga alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Polkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old one. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond to establish trust. No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Are your hands clean, Bell? Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. I don't think so. You're still holding back on us, and we are gonna get it out of you. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the game of Earth, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. This is your chance to find out who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Perseus, the CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Rejecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Alright guys. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. That baby 
be hits for like 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to knock out the AA guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Let's take first and off the air. I have grass, grass, oh, I have grass, I have grass. Ashley, you see this? Woods, we're running out of time. I gotta tell Hudson to launch. That's a big gamble if that gun ain't cleared. Yeet! 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 I'm eating some grass.
should have like died. That's sad. The guy needs to screw off, man. Mr. President, they stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. I'll be damned. It's a ball. My hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah, after capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East, and with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azalea's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. Just, yes. It'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us. Thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? We may have saved it from getting blown to Kingdom Come, but it's still stacked with Perseus's agents. There's more we could have done there if we'd had the time. And Bell.
Arctic air. Clears the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. The betrayal. All right, guys. If you have enjoyed this Call of Duty campaign, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe. We're trying to hit a thousand subscribers. That'll mean so much to me. Um, make sure to check below if you, the entire video. If you haven't watched them all, they will be in the playlist below. Um, make sure. To Leave a like down below, subscribe, like I said already. Uh, just check, it doesn't hurt, and Tyler is out.